Brandon from Techie Dad here. It's April. We got a, another Alien 3D monthly box. Let's check it out. And welcome back. Here's the monthly box for April. Let's open it and see what's inside, shall we? All right, well, right here on top, looks like there's a personalized note from Josh, a owner of Alien 3D. Um, looks like it's basically saying that there was an issue with the brochures, especially like during Murph, um, while we were doing the community Alien 12 foot um, big print project that was going on. So it was uh, really nice to see that. You guys should be able to check out some of the links for Murph and see the, the big giant alien head. Um, but I guess there was some issues with the brochure this month, but that's okay. I mean, we're not really here for the brochure anyway. We're here for the stuff inside, so let's get to it. So it looks like we got a little monster magazine, or comic. That's pretty neat. Ooh, what do we got here? Some 3D clean purge material for FDM. That is nice. Some little pre-made uh, purging sticks for the extruder. Nice little case for everything. Oh, looks like we got a motor or something for a project. A sticker. Alright, first filament is by Filament 1. Pro Select PLA Aqua Color. Look pretty awesome. Uh, extrusion 195-215. Bed temp 50-60. to 60. Uh, Again, PLA. Don't necessarily need to have a bed heat, but you know, it's a nice little feature to sometimes get it to stick a little better, so definitely have to check out that. We have WYZ Works uh, PLA Chocolate, uh, 180 to 230 extrusion temp, 0 to 60 for the bed. And through this, it's a little hard to see. There you go, it might be a little better, but it does look like the Hershey bar chocolate. That's pretty awesome. And I'm probably going to butcher the name here, but Tansy. And my PLA Cerulean. 180 to 210. Bed temp 20 to 50. A little odd to put the 20, but I guess better adhesion to at least have a little bit of heat more than just room temperature would probably help. Um, but that is a very nice baby blue, blue color. That'll be fun to print with. And it looks like the last one is from 3D Passion. Perfect Peach. 190 to 210. Bed temp 20 to 60. Again, a little odd for the temperature, but you know, hey, a little bit of adhesion for the bed is better than none. And hopefully that's getting a nice, that's a real peach color. That is pretty awesome. All right. Well, when I was looking online, it did show that for this project there um, is a waterfall and here's the little water pump with uh, the bracket to bolt it down. Oop, I got it facing the wrong way. There we go. Little snap in bracket, do a little water pump. Uh, the two little features uh, look like it had for one of the walls. That it, the water just trickles down or one that's like a, a spiral pump that comes up from the center and then kind of flows around the outside in different shapes. Um, I'll put a link to the description page for it, but it looks really neat. Um, so yeah, that's uh, we only got one sticker this time, but that's okay. We got a whole wall full of stickers from Murph. Um, it's always fun to get stickers. So now we got one from JT. Is in Australia, so that is pretty awesome. Love to support the community, and yeah, so look forward to uh, some content with all of this stuff. Kids are gonna have a blast playing with water. I mean, what kid doesn't? Even this big kid. I'm really looking forward to having some little clean sticks, because you know everybody's extruder always gets a little gunky when changing from reds to other colors. So this would be nice, uh, good purge, cleaning PLA, and big thanks for Josh 
to really just kind of put a personal touch on everything. You know, we really do appreciate what you do for the community. And as you have in here, even though things might be going a little tough on the personal side, but as far as the business side, you always take care of us and we always look forward to another month. Thank you again and have fun printing.